Creek Jewelers, located at 111 South Washington Street. Creek Jewelers is an IJO master jeweler, giving you the brilliance you deserve. Stop in and see their Diva Diamonds. Divinity is in the details. Creek Jewelers always features professional and courteous service and quality merchandise at affordable prices. Come see for yourself how you can make an ordinary day special with a gift from Creek Jewelers at 111 South Washington Street. You can call them at 3620603. From the Paper News 24-7 Newsroom, here is your police blotter for Tuesday, April 19, 2011. Brought to you by Creek Jewelers, 111 South Washington Street, downtown Crawfordsville. On Sunday, Crawfordsville Police Department responded to a break-in alarm. Shady Knoll, the building check secure, 12.02 p.m., Request to speak with an officer regarding child custody, East County Road 50 South, 1256 p.m. A female reported assault, Brenda Avenue, 140 p.m. Lost stolen license plate on Grace Avenue, 155 p.m. Female requested officer reference civil dispute with ex-husband, Indian Springs, 231 p.m. Disabled vehicle, State Road 32 at State Road 47 North, 2.20 p.m. A loose pit, ball was, pit bull was reported, Market and Morgan Street, 2.51 p.m. Request to speak with an officer, reference a civil dispute, Southgate, 3.33 p.m. Disabled vehicle, U.S. 231 North of County Road 550 North, 3.54 p.m. An officer spoke to two male juveniles at the Salt Pile, Fremont and Dunn. He told them not to go near there again, 5.05 p.m. Harassment reported, 2055 Hollybush Court, 5.11 p.m. Breaking alarm, Cummings Mental Health, 703 Inglewood Drive. The building check secure, 5.55 p.m. Article picked up at police station by a friend of the owner, 6 p.m. An officer checked out a vehicle parked off the road, U.S. 231 North at Calvary. It checked OK, 6.43 p.m. Unlawful entry to the Ben-Hur building reported, 221 East Main. Two people were seen entering the building. The door was found to be open, and it could not be secured, 7.49 p.m. Injured dog reported in the roadway on U.S. 231 near the KOA campground. Harassment reported South Pine Street, 8.56 p.m. Domestic disturbance, Vinewood Court, 9.10 p.m. Suspicious person reported in the alley behind the Red Cross office, 10.07 p.m. Vandalism to Sugar Creek Eye Clinic. The back door was painted, 1090 East Main Street. 10.50 a.m. Gas America North said a vehicle struck their building, 2605 Lafayette Road, 11.39 a.m. Walk-in reported wallet stolen at the Lou Wallace Inn, 12.32 p.m. Montgomery County Sheriff's Office on Sunday responded to a report of a disabled truck and trailer, I-74 eastbound at the 35-mile marker, 5.55 p.m. A disabled green sports car, I-74 eastbound at 46-mile marker, 7.01 p.m. Domestic disturbance, north U.S. 231, 7.24 p.m. Disabled semi, I-74 eastbound at the 28-mile marker, 8.55 p.m. Report of possible burglary at a farm south of North 800 East in Darlington. People had permission to be there, police said, and that happened at 8 p.m. Vandalism to a driveway with white paint, Gladiator Drive in Waynetown, 9.23 p.m. An officer assisted a motorist who was out of gas at the Wingate Town Hall, 11.10 p.m. On Monday, a resident complained loud voices woke him up on Dunn Avenue, 120 a.m., County Highway Department said their vehicle struck and killed a dog, and three, there were other dogs running loose in the area. County Road 700 North, east of 275 West, 1025 a.m. Residential breaking alarm reported, West Country Club Road, 1211 p.m. There was a black, black cow in the road, State Road 25, just south of 650 North, 
Farmers contacted and they put the cow away, 12.25 p.m. Arrests. Crawfordsville Police Department on Saturday arrested Cindy Dye, 59, of Crawfordsville, for possession of controlled substance and leaving the scene of a property damage accident, 4.01 p.m. Sunday, Robert Swanson, 24, of Crawfordsville, was arrested for operating while intoxicated, 3.53 a.m. Ernest Lester, 34, of Crawfordsville, was arrested on a warrant for check deception, 4.20 p.m. John B. Peterman was arrested on a warrant for non-support of child, 10.03 p.m. On Monday, Boyd Christensen was arrested for criminal mischief, 12.15 a.m. The Montgomery County Sheriff's Office on Saturday arrested William D. Stull, 26, of Lafayette, for operating while intoxicated, 9.55 p.m. Accidents. Montgomery County Sheriff's Office on Friday investigated an accident involving Jeffrey D. Clore of Waynetown, who struck a deer, State Road 32 West at County Road 400 West, 3.40 p.m. Kenzie D. Reynolds of Waveland, who ran off the road, County Road 800 West at 1050 South, 536 p.m. Tanya S. Smith of Colfax ran off the road and inverted. She was transported to Witham Hospital in Lebanon, 835 p.m. On Sunday, Stephen D. McDonald of Noblesville struck a deer, I-74 at the 28-mile marker, 945 p.m. Fire runs. Crawfordsville Fire Department on Sunday responded to a report of an oven fire, 2033 Clover Drive, 416 p.m. Smoke coming from the Jiffy Lube Building, 1504 South Washington, 415 p.m. And a truck on fire at the U.S. 231 North Truck Stop, 1012 p.m. And though that is your police blotter for Tuesday, April 19, 2011. Brought to you by Creek Jewelers, 111 South Washington Street, downtown Crawfordsville. I'm Frank Phillips reporting.